What's good, guys? If you want cheap, fast, and reliable NBA 2K20 My Team coins, head on over to NBAsafe.com and use code BUGS for 5% off at checkout. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Bugs, back on another NBA 2K21 My Team video. And guys, today... We are going to go over the auction block in NBA 2K21, my team, and how you guys are going to make MT so far this year. If you guys are new, smash that like button, drop the sub, all that good stuff, because we're going to make a lot of MT. We're going to post a lot of videos today. And guys, since it does realistically drop at 12 Eastern tonight, I did get the game early. But yo, we're going to go over it. Oh, my dog's got to be annoying. But yo, we're going to go over the auction. We're going to go over a bunch of things in this video, man. A lot of things in this video. So let's get into the auction, man. First thing you guys want to do, okay? Let's say you pull one of these Amethyst cards, okay? If you guys are new to the game, how do you work the auction, man? Pretty much it's simple, okay? Right now, Amethyst is the highest tier. We got the Ruby. That's a pretty high tier. And then we got Sapphire, Emerald, whatever. So right now, it does Diamonds, Pink Diamonds. They're not on the auction yet, okay? Only Amethyst stars. So now... How to work the auction, man. It's easy. You really just want to go maximum buyout. That's really the only thing you really want to touch ever. So, for instance, man, if you guys have any of these Amethyst cards, I would recommend selling them as soon as possible. You're going to see them drop to probably around 20,000 MT. Um, last year, man, we made a lot of MT off this filter. This, these, this filter right here, since it does conclude a collector level or whatever, you get 10 tokens per set, okay? That's very, that's not a lot at all. So, so let's say you pull Giannis, right? People are going to want to do the set. So you're going to see his price drop. Not only that, you're going to see a lot of cards drop this whole entire year. Considering the fact that in this year, guys, in May 2K21, there's 4,000 cards collected to get Jason Tatum. So that pretty much means there's going to be a crazy amount of content coming in this game. With that being said, man. These cards are not going to be nowhere near the price you see them at now. They're going to just continue to drop. Not only that, these sets only give you 10 tokens. So with 30 teams, you're only going to get 300 tokens. Now looking at this, whatever, think about it, man. So if you think about it, once you get on the game, if you pull any cards, guys, if you will pull any cards, any cards, gold cards, emerald cards, just sell them off as soon as possible because realistically, man, these cards are not going to go for anything. As you guys can see, Bronze cards, emeralds, it's going to be hard to make MT within the first couple days, man. These first couple days are very crucial. It's going to be hard to snipe. Only thing I'm going to say is, on release, man, you should probably hop on the auction very easily. So now, how are you going to make MT day one, bro? I'm telling you right now, the Ruby filter is probably going to be the most money filter, the most profitable filter in the game of day one. The rubies are going to be posted every single second. Same with, obviously, the Ami 20s. That one's going to be a lot harder to get snipes on, though. But ruby filter, man, sapphire filter, you should be able to make boatloads of MT easily. Wow, I sold my Kyrie for 6,900. So now, how are you going to make MT, man? It's simple. You just constantly snipe on this filter. New stuff pop up. It's going to be pretty easy to make MT this year. Now, explaining the auction house, man. What do you need to know? How do you get the auction house? Well... If you hop into my team, man, how to get the auction house, I'm pretty sure you got to go to collector level. Uh, let's see. Where's collector level? So, uh, la, 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 la. where is collector level? La, 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 la. My team unlimited. No single player. No collector level. This is it. Nope. So, I don't know. Where is collector level? I have no idea. But, I'm pretty sure you just need 30 cards to unlock the auction. Ooh, we got a locker code, blah, 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 blah. Wow, Giannis over 60K. So the largest auction house sale so far is 60K. That's weak. Pink Diamond reward player are you going after first? Probably Steph Curry. Or No, nah, I like Paul Pierce. One token. All right, I'll take that free token. But yo, right now, pretty much, explain the auction block, guys. Pretty much all you have to do is whatever you get, just make sure to sell as soon as possible. These cards are not going to last for much longer. Every single card you see in this video is very expensive. All you have to do, man, to make MT is literally go to auctions. Now, how to sell your cards. You pretty much just go to collection, which is in my team. You go to collection, premium, or whatever it is. Let's say you got Giannis, right? Let's say I got, you got Chris Middleton, right? You go here. You go send to my auctions. You press send to my auctions, okay? I'm going to do it with a bum. 
So we're gonna go to this Udonis Haslam semi auctions, right? Go to auctions, see he's right here. You just go start auction, blah 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 blah. And now it's very easy, man. Very easy to work this auction. You just go search auctions, Udonis Haslam. That's it, man. That's all you gotta do. I usually just move up the maximum buyout, man. Um, that's it right there, twelve hundred. So he's going for twelve hundred. I'll throw him up for twelve hundred. Actually, I'll put one in my collection because I have one. So honestly, this is all you have to do. Bronzes are going for like twelve hundred right now. This is probably your best chance to sell your cards. Um, the market's just going to continue to crash, man. There's nothing valuable. There's no diamonds. There's no nothing. So that's all I'm going to say, man. Just continue to sell your cards. Whatever cards you have, duplicates, whatever cards you have in general, make sure to sell them, man. This is going to be the best way to make NT here on and here out. So, um, yeah. Shoes also, man. Pretty much. The auction right now is going to be dry. Only thing, bro, just add with this rubies. Constantly, constantly check what's going on how to work the auction man it's simple maximum buyouts now let's say you have like 15k mt like me you want to make quick quick mt okay all i know is that some silver cards actually are going to be somewhat rare so if i were you man let's see silver so look at this we got bradley beal for a thousand ah oh, we missed it so i would have made 1500 mt i think this sapphire filter right here might be the best filter to actually use 1300 chris middleton we just got that um so chris middleton man i think i'm actually gonna make a pretty decent profit off that let's check his value uh we did just get him so right there man that is our first snipe of the year let's see how much he's going for 1500 i think i just bought that oh no okay 1900 all right we're gonna make some decent mt 1952 all right we're gonna buy this one too we're buying all of them and we're gonna throw them up for a little bit more so he's up for 2500 so we're gonna sell both of them for 2500 we're gonna make about 1500 mc so oh we actually got a lot so yeah 1500 mc if they sell for 25 in which i think they will i just use him in a game he has a very good jump shot so we're throwing them up there hopefully they all sell that'll be a w i'll make about 2000 profit in a couple minutes so yeah man that's pretty much how you're gonna make a lot of mt sapphire snipes should be popping up a lot there should be a ton of Sapphire snipes going around, a ton of Ruby snipes going around. And honestly, man, this is going to be the best way to make MT quickly. The Sapphire filter. Let's check out the Silver filter. Silvers are kind of rare. Some Silvers. So now, all I'm going to say, uh, some Silvers in these collections are going to be rare, okay? You're going to try to want to find the rare Silver in each set. Maybe you can snipe them out, and I promise you they will sell. Some Silvers will be rare. It doesn't look like they have heat checks this year. Honestly, that's a huge W. Uh, let's see ben mclemore he's pretty rare so see one rare silver right here three thousand ben mclemore Ooh, jeff green for one thousand i'm gonna take the bet i'm gonna buy that because there is only one on the auction this is what you want to do man if you could somehow get a hold of a bunch of silvers and let's say i'm gonna throw them for 4k someone might need them for the set you never know and this starter pack set man we did pull boogie cousins but yeah pretty much man that's how i'm explaining the auction there's like no better way to explain it there's no better way to make MT right now, man. This is going to be the best way. I gave you the best methods to make MT. So put it in the back of your head. Make some MT. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you didn't check out the pack opening, make sure to check out the pack opening. Hope you guys did enjoy, man. Have a good one. Peace.